Hello everyone and welcome! A little while back I went over some of the worst habits players have while playing Power and Mithra. So I thought to kick off the new year let's talk about some things that will actually help you improve with these two. I want to start with the tip that helped me the most and that is to play the character strictly in the situation they excel in. Also known as play Mithra in neutral and Pyra in advantage. The goal, in simple terms, is to play Mithra until you win neutral, then pressure with Pyra until her stock is gone. If it doesn't work out, switch back to Mithra and repeat the process. I have oversimplified things a lot here, but that is essentially what it boils down to. Second tip I want to talk about is actually the opposite of the previous one. I know, crazy. Bear with me though. What I'm saying here is to play Pyra and Mithra in situations you normally wouldn't. Experiment, if you will. Play Pyra in neutral or low percent. Play Mithra at kill percent or at the ledge. Heck, go off stage and edgeguard with both of them. My main point here is building experience and being familiar with many situations and scenarios with both characters. Please, I encourage you all to experiment and play around with them as much as possible. There is a reason why I'm able to seal out stocks in the most unexpected ways and that's because I put in the effort to experiment. I really love playing Pyre at low percent, I swear it's a drug. Last thing I want to talk about today is... Switch off of Pyra if you fail to seal out the stock. Seriously. Just because the opponent's numbers are in the red it doesn't mean Pyra needs to be out until the stock is gone. I'm also guilty of this, but it's one of the most common mistakes people do. A good rule of thumb is, if the opponent gets back to neutral, you switch back. As I said earlier on in this video, if things don't work out, switch back to Mithra. Because let's be real for a moment, Pyra is not winning neutral anytime soon. Unless the matchup is just that good. But yeah, that's mainly the stuff I wanted to discuss today. I know some points are a bit conflicting, but I hope it makes sense. Got any tips yourself? Please let me and everyone else know in the comments. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you soon.